Our mission is to bring a nutrient-rich food source to the world's growing population while also um, protecting our oceans. Aquaculture Foods is a uh, food tech company located in Chicago, and our mission is to bring a nutrient-rich food source to the world's growing population while also um, protecting our oceans. So we started the company back in 2020, and the last three and a half years, we've spent um, really um, optimizing our products and getting it ready for market approval. And so we just got our regulatory approval in July, and literally we launched last week in Chicago with a fine dining restaurant. Now, how are you different from others that are in this space? We're quite different because our tuna and our scallops and all of the products that we're creating are really meant to be eaten raw. So our products in its natural state mimic the appearance, the taste, the texture, and that whole mouthfeel and eating experience of traditional raw seafood. Um, and because of that, we can be, we don't have to hide our products in breadings or mix it with starches and gums. Um, it truly can stand alone and be um, really the center of a dish. So we're showcasing our products to Michelin star chefs and restaurants as like a crudo or a tartare or a ceviche. And so we say that you don't have to hide our product. It can kind of live on its own and really be the center of the plate and surprise and delight consumers that are looking for the eating experience of traditional seafood, but without, on a, without the baggage of our polluted oceans. Now, as you look to the next 12 months, what are your priorities? So we're continuing to scale up in our pilot facility. So we have a 5,000 square foot facility in Chicago. About half of that is our pilot production. So we're self-manufacturing today. So we're continuing to scale up there and we're also gonna be expanding our distribution. So we just launched and we're gonna continue to grow our distribution throughout Chicago. Um, and then also look to the other major markets in the U.S. before launching in Europe and Asia. And we're actually also opening our Series A round of financing next month. So we'll be raising $10 million to support all of that upcoming growth. Brittany, it's been wonderful to talk with you. Thanks for joining me on Floor Talk. Thank you, Jude. I appreciate it.